my intermediate, I came across my SE caste certificate wherein religion was mentioned as another faith. I was told it cannot be changed to Christian, then the certificate would be invalid. God gave me conviction that I cannot use the certificate and get the benefits of the garment with the wrong identity. And by using this certificate, I felt like I'm telling the garment that I don't belong to Jesus and I belong to someone else. My dad was afraid that I would not get into a good engineering college without it. But I believed in God and trusted that he would bless me according to his riches and not according to my talents when I submit to him. I started giving competitive exams without any caste certificate and God gave me faith to trust in him completely. God gave me a seat in one of the top five colleges in our state. It is very difficult to get a first job for a civil engineer. Even if we get, the salaries would be very meager. By the grace of God, I got placed with a good package in one of the top core MNC for which I very casually gave interview because I thought that I would not get it as there were others who were much more deserving than me. Even in my job, I got promoted to assistant manager in just one year, then to technical officer in another 10 months, which was a position that would usually be given to a person with four to five years experience. Two years into the company, God put me in a position where half of Hyderabad's quality team of my company would report to me. I had a desire to go abroad for masters, but did not have the finances for it. All I had was a promise of God that I would go. I held on to it and prayed about it and believed that where there is promise, there would be provision. I got an admission from university in Canada, and now the challenge was to get a loan without collateral. That's when God brought in my brother's friend who was a manager in the bank that I was applying loan from. And he helped me apply for a loan and got it sanctioned on the same day for the full amount and all the verification formalities were done after sanctioning my loan, which was a miracle. I got my visa and would be flying on the 29th of this month. I really thank God for the pastors, leaders, friends and the fellowship with OPC we share and the platform that the church provides to use our talents for the glory of God. I am Tarun Gandharam and this is my story of hope.